Hello, how are you? Welcome to CUO, where we promote empowering information about Africa. We're here to build the continent. My name is Choi Sufuma Okoro, and today I come to you as a proud Nigerian. Um, there are many Nigerians who find reasons to leave. I'm one of those who've decided to come back and I've been monitoring the elections. I am, do not belong. I do not belong to any political party, but I'm very committed and passionate about ensuring more women run in elective offices. Right now, I think uh, Nigeria is a great country, doing very well, but our ratio and rate in terms of the women who have voted into elective offices is very abysmal, is very low. And my mission and commitment is to correct it. Let me give you some facts. At the eighth assembly, which is 2015, there were seven female senators out of 109. So only seven, and we had 102 men and just seven women. There were 22 female representatives out of 360 in 2015, which we call the eight assembly. Now let's look at that ratio. Let me repeat it. Seven female senators out of 109 senatorial positions, which means we had 102 male senators and just seven female senators. And then the same in terms of female representatives, 22 female representatives out of 360. That is not good enough. <laughs> then let's go to night assembly, which is 2019. We had seven female senators out of 109 the same as the eight assembly. So we repeated what we had in 2015. We found the same in 2019. Then we've just concluded the elections for 2023, which is the 10th assembly. And we have even gone lower than we did before. We have female senators out of 109. So we're going down, we're performing poorer than we did in the two other assemblies. Then we have 15 representatives after 360 seats. So we've done worse than we did before. My passion and commitment is this. Our goal is to increase the number of women who run for elective office. I'm putting my time, my resources, financial and time into this. I'll be raising funds. I've set up a foundation to raise funds. I'll put my money in to make sure women who want to run for elective office are supported. By the time we run the next election, in I believe in the next four years, we're going to be monitoring how well we do. I do not, we do not belong to any political party. We support all parties. Our goal is to increase the number of women who are supported to run for elective office. Rwanda, half of Rwanda's cabinet of women, is the same for Pakistan, is the same for Ethiopia. I had the privilege to serve with the United Nations in, in Ethiopia and Pakistan, and I can attest to the fact that half of their cabinet are women. Rwanda, I didn't serve there, but I know how well they've done. We want to make sure Nigeria gets there. So work with me. I'll be back with you on this issue. I'll be updating you weekly on this issue. And I know we can do it because it's Nigeria. We do what we can to make us the greatest in the world. And I'm for Nigeria, proudly Nigerian, made in Nigeria. We need more women to run for elective office in Nigeria. The record so far is not what Nigeria should be presenting to the world. Thank you.